Okay, you guys. Birdie's quick tip. Does it look very blurry to you? I was just... Kids aren't here. Grandkids aren't here yet. They're coming over to stay for a little while while mom and oldest one go on a date. I had this glue stick package and this plastic. What I did was I cut the flat part out of a couple sides. It, it's plastic. And I took a page. I have some really large pages that I didn't know what to do with. So I folded one over and made it so that, you know, it's going to go in my book but it's doubled and I cut out some of those pieces of plastic and I'm going to glue them in here to make some windows and let them dry. So I just thought I'd take you guys on my little journey till the kids got here and show you what I'm doing to make my little windows. I cut my hole, I traced my window on there and then I cut my hole a little smaller. So on the inside, all I have to do is go in and put my glue around the edges. Put my little window in. I didn't worry about my window being perfectly straight because it's going to be hidden inside of here. Then I'm putting a little more glue around this window and everywhere else. And you know what? I better go ahead and do this one too while I'm here because I'm about to glue my page together. It'll make it hard to get to if I don't. Put my little window in. And my glue around and zippity doo dah. When it dries, we'll have two pages with windows in them. How nifty will that be? So, I guess we'll just call this a little tip from Birdie. I got a little string of glue on there, but I am not going to touch it while it's wet because... It will smear and look ucky. I'd rather just have a string of glue than a smear. And it may roll off later when it dries. So, there you go, folks. I'll lay something heavy on that till it's dry. And we will have two pages with windows in them. Bye-bye from Birdie.